Hello, we are going to use the model of the heart um, to learn about the circulation of blood from the heart to all the organs and the tissues of the human body and then coming back to the heart and that is known as the systemic circulation. So I'm going to point to some of the heart parts and blood vessels showing on the heart that are associated with the systemic uh, circulation. So we're going to start with the left ventricle. containing oxygenated blood. The left ventricle will pump the blood into the ascending aorta, then to the aortic arch, down to the lower body through the descending aorta. This is the brachiocephalic artery and this is the left common carotid artery and this is the left subclavian artery they will take the blood to the head area and to the arms. When the blood gets to the organs and the tissues, the tissues and the cells will pick up the oxygen from the blood and they will get rid of the carbon dioxide. Then the blood will come back to the heart The inferior vena cava will bring the blood from the lower part of the body. The superior vena cava will bring the blood from the upper part of the body. And all of the deoxygenated blood returning to the heart, it will return to the right atrium. So that is the systemic circulation.